Some companies are considered to be pandemic companies. Some are pre-pandemic. Some are post-pandemic. Where does George Kurtz fit in in a world where maybe we're going to go back to work and work at home? Uh, we've got all the software we need now. We've got cybersecurity protection. Well, let's think about this. Do we really think that that the, the bad guys are going to give up just because everyone's going back to work and the pandemic hopefully is winding down? We all hope that. Uh, the answer is no. Security has never been more critical. It doesn't matter whether you're at home, at work, work from anywhere. We think about the cloud opportunity and the large cloud providers. As people move their workloads from on-premise to in the cloud, massive opportunity, greenfield for us. And um, it's just a proliferation of these workloads that need to be protected. So. For, from our standpoint, COVID, um, obviously, uh, it was something that we had to get through, but the digital transformation that's happening along with security transformation is really a sustainable tailwind to CrowdStrike's business. Oh, and last question. You've mentioned many times companies. When I look at the landscape, uh, the weakest part of our whole, whole country, maybe the government, they're almost all on legacy systems. What can you do for the government? The great news is we have technology that helps stop breaches. And I think as the government looks to modernize their architecture and they're going down that path, then CrowdStrike would be a great fit. We've got success in areas of the government, both state, local, and the federal government, as well as governments around the world. And uh, we think we'll play a critical role in protecting these, uh, these infrastructures uh, around the globe. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer, hashtag mad tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.